This is Josh Taylor and you're watching Boxing Social. This is Rob Tebbett for Boxing Social. I'm delighted to be joined by the still unbeaten Chantel Cameron. We're here at the Taylor Postal Undercard in Glasgow. How are you, Chantel? Great performance. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. So, what did you make of your performance? Six round TKO against somebody who boxed for a world title two weeks ago? Um, it was like a le never learning fight because the first three rounds I was quite slow, weren't getting my feet going. She was really tricky as well, she was like wild. So, first three rounds weren't great, but then I started finding my rhythm, finding my shots, and got the stoppage. Now, what's this week been like for you? Because as I understand it, you've had another case with a couple of opponents have pulled out. Are you used to it by now? I mean, I know this has happened to you quite a lot for your career. Do you get used to it or has it, has it been something that you've had to sort of to keep on an even kill? It was really frustrating because obviously um, in the light, lightweight division, there's all these champions and I want to be challenging the champions. And um, like there was offers made to a few of them and they didn't take the offer so and then I had opponents like pulling out on me so, so it's been quite a frustrating few weeks and this week on Monday I had another change of opponents so it's frustrating because I got my mindset for one opponent and then she pulled out and then a new one came in so it's frustrating obviously I want to progress and I can't progress when the girls aren't like letting me challenge them for their, their belt so it's been a frustrating week but I got the win so that's all that matters didn't seem like you suffered from any sort of, you didn't look to have suffered from that in the build up, you were ripping to the body nicely, you were varying your shots well, what do you feel that you still have to work on based on your performance tonight? Um, I was messy, there was times where I was really messy and I was being caught, I was being like dragged into her, so I was letting her um, set the clumsiness and tying me up and I've got to learn to not get involved in that, well, I don't have to, like in sparring in the gym, I can keep it long, I can box. But I think the fight night gets the better of me and I just go gun high and get a bit excited. But you're still somebody who's very, very early in your professional career despite achieving an awful lot in that short space of time. With that being said, where's next for you? Hopefully I'll be challenging one of the girls for their books. Hopefully, if they take the fight. Okay, and just lastly, a word on tonight's main event. Your stablemate Josh Taylor faces Victor Pistol in WBC final eliminator. What's your prediction for fight night? I'm sure you're going to be backing your man. I think Josh is going to stop him, I do. It, round five, six. Okay, well, Chantel, wham, bam, Cameron, thanks very much for speaking to Boxing Social. We'll look forward to catching up with you soon. Thanks.